When you're removing the handle, what you have to figure on is that a lot of parts on the sword might have been custom fit to only go on in one direction. The way you keep everything straight is you lay it down in which up. We assume that this is always going to be up because this is the way you take the sword apart. Up is always up when you lay them down. So we take the handle off here, lay that aside. Now we have the spacer and we keep that the same way up. We lay it right on the floor. Now the guard comes. Guards are tricky. Some guards, they'll, they'll, they are tricky. You have to tap them off. So we keep up, up. So you can lay them down. And now this is called habiki, I think it's called, or something like that. What I learned is to take, these often are stuck on, and you can't get them off. But if yours come off, the best way to take it off is to not squeeze it from the edge, because you'll break the seam. You squeeze it from the sides, and that's how they pop right off. You actually make the thing bigger when you squeeze it from the sides. And now that's off, and now we're ready to uh, examine the sword, well, and start cleaning it. Thank you.